Well, good morning, everybody. It is Thursday, May 2nd. I'm Maggie Fleckno, and this is Houston Happens. Happy Friday Eve. We are already getting you ready for the weekend. So coming up on today's show, Mother's Day. It is just around the corner. Can you believe it? Well, friend of the show and tech guru, Jennifer Jolly, is here with some great gadget gift ideas. Or how about this? If you're more about making memories as a gift, we have a fun way you can celebrate mom right here in H-Town. Spoiler alert, it features a Ninja Warrior style obstacle course. I don't know if I'm up for that one, but some of you might be up for the challenge. It's pretty cool. And it is the biggest Kentucky Derby party here in Houston. Julep is getting down and derby this Saturday with ice cold mint juleps, cocktails, delicious food, hats, and so much more. They're actually live in studio shaking things up. So we're off to the races, so to speak. Let's get this show started. But more on a serious note, today is also a big day for weather in and around the Houston area. And even before today's weather moved in, rains from previous days have left communities to the northeast of Harris County underwater and dealing with flood emergencies. It just leaves a pit in your stomach. That's why Harris County Precinct 4 has actually deployed resources to help people impacted by the storms. This equipment includes two five-ton trucks you see there, two rescue boats, and manpower will also be available. All, as always, please remember, turn around, don't drown. Unless you are leaving a flooded area, please also stay off of the roads. It's not worth it. Some schools around the impacted areas are closed or delayed. Shepherd ISD is implementing a weather closure for today. Huntsville and Willis ISD are also closed for today. Dayton ISD is implementing a two-hour delay for the start of school. Of course, we have all this information on our website as well, CW39.com. And we have team coverage this morning tackling the flooding that continues to plague communities to our northeast. So let's check in with Seth, who's back in Idlewild subdivision in northeast Harris County. I know you were up there yesterday, Seth. How is it looking today? Rainy, yeah, to say the least. It. It's been pouring here for, yeah, I'm having to hide out in the car. I'd be out in the rain, but it's also lightning, and it's been doing so for the better part of an hour now. So these folks are very soggy. They had water into homes in the Idle Wide subdivision, which is just right over there. 100 people live there, and a lot of folks had to be rescued yesterday. The water was gone down overnight. In fact, where I am along FM 1485, which is still closed off, by the way, because of the flooded East Fork of the San Jacinto River, it is better today. But yes, the flooding is still there, and you wonder with all this rain if it's only going to go right back up. So uh, let's go ahead and show some video now of what I was able to record yesterday. Lots of flooding going on in the Idle Wild subdivision and also some rescues going on. This little tug at your heartstrings. About five dogs were rescued and put up on that high profile truck there and that shirtless man as well. He kind of struggled to get on board himself. Hopefully he's doing okay and those pups are as well. Now I want to show you also a nearly flooded house. There were some homes that actually got water in them in the Idle Wild subdivision. This one in particular did did not get water in it. It was right up to it, though. Another inch or two, and it could have gotten inside. The man who lives there is convinced the water's going to go back up, and he's going to have damage. It's dry. It ain't made it inside yet. I was hoping that it wouldn't get this far. Now that it is, and with the rain on the way, it's going to make it in. Yeah, it's not going to have time to do it. The ground's already saturated. And we're getting so much more rain today on top of that saturated ground. But that man headed for high ground with his wife and dog and important documents. So hopefully they're doing okay. And hopefully everyone over there in that subdivision and so many places that are experiencing flooding today, flash flooding for today's storms and then river flooding from the storms over the weekend. A messy day here in Houston weather-wise. Maggie. Seth, I have to ask because I worry about you two driving. How are the roads in the area you getting in and out? And that rain, it makes me nervous. I, it's pouring. Right, yeah, the drive to this location at about 5 this morning was fine. It was misty. Now it's just pouring, so you got to be safe out there. I've actually stayed put for the last three hours or so. I'm about to find out just how bad they are, so maybe I'll let you know, and you can let the viewers know a little later on. Okay, and you just be safe. Thank you. Excellent reporting, as always, Seth. I appreciate you.
And meanwhile, our CW39 Houston's Kara Wills is standing by in Dayton now in Liberty County, where some areas are flooded as well. Others, though, thankfully, were in the clear. So, Kara, let's see if we can get her signal. I know with this weather, it's always hard to get people up. We just want to check base and see what's going on out there. As always, if you have any questions about a certain area or if you want to help, please go over to our website, CW39.com. Also, this is such a great tool. Our CW39 weather app, just download our app. I get all of the alerts right to my phone, especially because this is just a reminder that it is severe weather season. So I believe we have Kara up right now. Kara, ooh, that does not look good behind you. How are things where you are? Well, Maggie, this actually just happened a few minutes ago. We had some light out here on County um, Road 133, but it got extremely dark. And you can see this road is completely underwater. We saw some folks earlier that were trying to make their way inside on this road, but then they quickly made a turnaround. Um, that advice we've been giving all morning, turn around, don't drown. They definitely followed that this morning. We've had some emergency vehicles from Liberty County that have also um, been on this road to monitor to make sure no one was stuck. You can see here on the side of the ditch here just how flooded things are here as well. But it goes beyond the ditch onto this pasture that you can see behind there. Mosquitoes are definitely out from all of the high water. But I also had a chance to speak to some folks who were impacted by what we're seeing right now. It's not every road here in Liberty County. It's definitely not as harsh as what Seth is experiencing right now where he is. Um, but it is starting to um, we're starting to see the lightning and hear the thunder. I'm sure you can hear that now too. But I spoke to Chief Deputy Billy Knox, and he says that this is not as bad as it was during Harvey, but it's definitely something that they're prepared to step in for if things get worse. The river hasn't crested yet, so I'm not sure that there may be some homes at uh, risk of flooding. As of right now, like I said, we haven't had that those calls come in. There may be some out there that have, but we haven't received anything. I know that Texas Parks and Wildlife has boats out right now in the northern part of the county. And they're just in the communities that are underwater. Typically, all those homes are built on stilts or are elevated. And so they're actually have a few boats out there now going to the different houses and seeing if people want to come out. And you see that thunder and lightning is getting worse behind me here right now. You're sure you should see that in a few moments. But the American Red Cross is also opening a shelter at Calvary Baptist Cleveland. Of course, if you're in an emergency and you're seeing this right now, please call 911. And of course, again, turn around and don't drown if you see flooding. I hear that thunder, Kara. Please go be safe. Make sure your signal's down. I don't want you to be in any jeopardy out there. Thank you. Excellent reporting as always. Every time that thunder and then seeing Seth having to be in his car, I mean, you know, this is really, it's gut-wrenching what some of these are, communities are having to deal with. Most definitely, and I do want to make sure everybody knows we actually have two types of flooding happening right now. We have the river flooding, which Seth and Kara have been covering here the past couple of days. Plus, on top of that, we also have some flash flood warnings happening. Here's a look right now on radar just to the right of me. I'm going to go ahead and zoom in to the north of I-10 area because that's where most of these storms are going to be hanging out here for the next couple hours. Hours. By this afternoon, these storms, so you guys know, will be falling further to the coastline. So yes, Houston, you are going to be getting some of these thunderstorms. But I just want to show you here these green lines. That is a flash flood warning. To give you some more information on these, they are going to be in effect until noon. For instance, this one happening for Harris, Liberty, and Montgomery County. We also have another flash flood warning happening for Harris, Liberty, Montgomery, San Jacinto County until 1030 this morning. And this is one of those situations. Maggie, where you just do not belong on the roadways because only six inches of rushing water is enough to take a car and just float it down the river. So everybody, please take heed to these flash flood warnings, especially if you are north of I-10. And Maggie, you see all of the lightning strikes. That is just intense mm. storms happening. We do have, uh, we did have some severe thunderstorm warnings earlier this morning, but overall there was just one or two. Now, I do want to talk about this significant flood happening is still for our rivers, and this is a look at the Trinity Basin where we have two gauges in flood territory here in our area. So here's a look at that river flood warning for the Trinity River, and there's Dayton Lakes where Kara is. We have two gauges right now. The purple means major flooding happening, and then for that orange, that means we have some minor flooding. So all the different gauges have different uh, 
uh, stages right now. But I do just want to quickly run through here. Trinity River, you'll see right here that Liberty one we've been watching all morning long. It is going to crest later on at 31.2 feet Maggie. So we still have rising levels along the Trinity River. San Jacinto's though, those will be going down here in the next couple of days. Oh my goodness. Good news and bad news. Thank you so much for breaking it all down for us. And everybody, please stay safe out there. You know what? Stay safe. And if you haven't done Mother's Day shopping, maybe just hunker down and do some of that. Because this Mother's Day, what better way to show mom how much you appreciate her than with a life-changing gadget? I know this mama could use one. So tech life expert and friend of the show, Jennifer Jolly, is joining us with some of her top picks for mom. It's always great to have you. Thanks for waking up with us. It is always so great to be here. Let's dive right in. You know, inflation's been no joke this year, and I want to offer you guys a pro tip. You know, while we want to spoil the mother figures in our lives, we don't want to break the bank. So I've been covering tech for almost two decades. Okay. I just found out that if you start with the PayPal app, there's a ton of cashback offers right at your own fingertips. And these are from places you're shopping anyway, like Best Buy, Ticketmaster, Walmart, and so many more. You just click to save the offer that you like on your mobile device, and then it automatically applies it when you use PayPal at checkout. You wanna just keep layering on those rewards? Well, you can earn we earn even more rewards on eligible purchases with PayPal's own MasterCard. That right there just gives you an additional 3% off when you use it to check out at PayPal. You can just keep layering on those deals and then you can say, see mom, you didn't raise a dummy. Don't let treasured memories get lost with the Kodak Slide and Scan Digital Film Scanner. It brings cherished memories back to life with a simple press of a button. Remember those old slides? Well, this lets you quickly and easily view, edit, and convert old color and black and white negatives and all those 50 millimeter slides. Converts them all and saves them forever to digital files, but it also lets you watch history come to life right on its five inch LCD screen. This, you guys, a profound bridge to the past and incredible peace of mind for the future. I just used it to find all these old slides. It's my parents' wedding, love this. Another one that I absolutely love, Sprig. This is Kohler's wellness brand. This lets moms transform daily routines into self-care rituals with an infusion device that connects directly to her shower head and adds aromatherapy pods and other skincare ingredients, the same kind of skin pampering goodness that you find at luxury spas. You can add on to the whole peaceful pampering vibe too with their line of natural candles, bath bombs, body and linen mists. And if you use code JOLLY15, you'll get 15% off across the board. Moms always tell me they want something heartfelt and homemade. I'm a mom, I agree, but I am a terrible DIYer. So what I use, also recommend the Cricut Joy Extra. This one gadget can do it all. It cuts more than 50 different materials like vinyl, cardstock, iron-on. It can also write, foil, and draw creating personalized, professional looking, full color stickers, labels, cards, tags, t-shirts, signs, basically anything you can imagine, which makes it absolutely perfect for honoring all moms, like those bonus moms, dog moms, plant moms. I mean, it is time to celebrate all women who mother. And you know what else moms everywhere deserve? A robot helper, <laughs> like the iRobot Roomba Combo Day 9 Plus Robot Vacuum and Mop, this automatically tackles messes with powerful vacuuming and deep scrub mopping. The mop itself lifts up when it's on the carpet and then when it's on hard floors, it vacuums and mops at the same time. It even drives itself back to its home base, empties dirt, refills liquid and charges back up. She doesn't have to lift a finger. One less chore, huge score. You can find all of these at my website at techish.com. Now, happy Mother's Day and back to you. Uh, happy Mother's Day to you. I have to say my best friend just got a cricket. She said it is a game changer, and I personally want one of those sprigs. All right, thank you so much. As always, a pleasure having you. Also, I'm so excited because we're about to get down and derby. My good friend Alba with Julep is in the house. Stay tuned for that. Friendship goals. <gasps> that deserves a hip bump. Get the bumping. <laughs> the neighborhood. Weekdays at 4 and 4:30 on CW39 Houston.
The new $1.99 Sonic Crispy Tender Wraps are here for a limited time in bold flavors like Hickory Barbecue or Cheesy Baja. Give yourself some TLC, tender, love, and chicken for only $1.99. Sonic Crispy Tender Wraps. Who can you call when you need immediate help any time of day or night, even when you're hundreds of miles away from home? Always giving you and your family peace of mind, knowing that people, benefits, and services are there for you 24-7. Over 50 million members rely on AAA, America's largest motor club and most highly recommended major roadside assistance provider. AAA's legendary roadside assistance is a network with over 50,000 vehicles that respond to more than 32 million assistance calls every year. If something happens and we're broken down, my family's not going to be stranded. There are so many benefits to membership, and AAA is there if you're locked out of your car, need a tow, run out of gas, have a flat tire, or a dead battery. You know, if you have one flat tire or one battery service, that membership fee pays for itself. Wherever you go, wherever you are, you can trust AAA to be there when you need them. Call AAA today and find out how much you can save. Houston, Texas. For four decades, Walker, Texas lawyer has represented the beautiful people of this beautiful city. But we know in this city, an accident can happen at any moment. Don't go against the insurance companies alone. They have their lawyers. You should have yours. If you've been injured in an accident, call Walker, Texas lawyer today and put four decades of experience on your side. Visit walkertexaslawyer.com today. Hello, I'm Andrew Womack, and I'd like to invite you to join me daily, every weekday, for the Gospel Truth broadcast right here on this station. The times are on your screen, but you know, this is just a program where I teach from God's Word things that have changed my life, and I know they would change yours. So check it out each weekday, the Gospel Truth broadcast right here on this station. I know, you can't take your eyes off the Sonic Garlic Butter Bacon Cheeseburger. Don't worry, it's not going anywhere. Here's why. Garlic butter, cheese, garlic butter, bacon, garlic butter. Need we say more? Sonic Garlic Butter Bacon Cheeseburger. Settle in for the best laughs on TV. I can get used to this. <laughs> Weeknights at 10 and 10.30 on CW39 Houston. baby at julep for its 10th annual kentucky derby party it's happening this saturday and joining us is owner james beard award winner i am so proud of her friend of the show my dear friend alba huerta thank you so much for waking up with us well thank you for having me 10 years you guys look at this Alba just showed this to me. This was your first poster. That was our very first derby poster. Oh my God! A little gift. Thank you very much. It's absolutely stunning. Not to mention the hats. I have been to your party. This is the place. There's only one place to watch the derby other than at Churchill Downs, and that's a julep. Yes, we always. Uh, it's a community event. I love throwing this party. I love pouring my heart into it. I love to see everyone dressed up. I yeah. think it's so fun. Like when we were trying on the hats, and I'm like, I get why people love this party because it's like fun, you look beautiful, and everybody's yeah. out having a good time. And it's daytime party, and then you can either go home or go out if you still want to. That's what I love. I make a whole day of it. Always be responsible, that's what we say. There's so many photo ops. I still have my photos from it and wearing the hats out there. Also, let's be real, julep. Clearly, you're known for your mint julep. We are, and we make so many of them. Um, I'm excited to make one for you okay, guys today. Okay, can you shake it up for me? Yeah, it's a really, really great and simple recipe. You get a little mint. Mm -hmm. And um, look how beautiful, it's so fresh. It's so fresh, and it smells amazing in here. Yes, I think, I think so too. And can I just talk about your bar tool? Is that what you <laughs> yes, call them? Yes. I don't even know. Like, look at this muddler. Can I have a copper muddler? Yes, you can have that copper muddler. <laughs> it is yours. Do you need me to muddle? Yes, so we muddle that. All right. Okay. It's a group effort here. And oh. so it gets a little mint, okay. a little sugar syrup. Mm, it smells so good. And for the good stuff, a nice pour. Beautiful. And she's her. not chintzy on her pour, y'all. So tell everybody what they can expect when it comes to the party. 
So we will have, of course, amazing music. The florals are always yes. stunning. We have a, uh, Michelle Wallace will be there. I don't know if you've heard of her. She's a very famous person. Yes. A top chef. She will be there um, also making food for us. And um, we have two different, uh, we have a band and two different DJs on the property. The property is going to look amazing. We always do our best to make it look like a green lawn with right. the most amazing florals everywhere. And are tickets and available? Tickets are available at uh, Derby, julepderbyday.com. Okay. And I have to brag on you. You are <laughs> quite remarkable, my friend. Tell everybody. No, I'm so proud of you. James Beard Award winner. Yes. Tell me about this. So we were awarded in 2022 the uh, Outstanding Bar Program uh, Award through the James Beard Foundation. And it has been an incredible journey. Um, we've been, uh, you know, this is our 10th year uh, with our Kentucky Derby Party. That means we are also 10 years old. Jeez. It's been a great, beautiful time. Um, I couldn't think of a better way to spend my time making drinks for a city and a people people that I love. Um, and we were awarded this this amazing um, this amazing honor. But it's always it comes from the heart. It comes from being um, in a place surrounded by people like you and mm. people that love us. And um, we're so grateful for the fact that people love coming to the bar. Well, cheers and to you. And she works so hard, you all. You have no idea. And to be a woman in this industry, it's not been easy. So. Cheers. Thank Cheers you. you. And happy 10th anniversary, you guys. Again, here is all of the information. We will, of course, have the information on our website. You want to go to Julep, and then we'll have it on our website, CW39.com. I'm so proud of you. And thanks for the hat. It's so festive. Cheers to good friends and making memories. <laughs> CW39's lifestyle show, Houston Happens, highlights local businesses every day. Our team's ready to help you reach more customers and grow your revenue. We'd love to speak with you. Please scan the QR code or email hhsales at cw39.com today. I wasn't sure what I wanted to do. The medical profession has so much opportunity. I chose the College of Healthcare Professions. They have flexible 100% online or on-campus programs. With in-person classes just two days a week. At CHCP, you can start a new career in as little as nine months. Which leaves more time for me. And for what's really important. Visit chcp.edu for the career of your life. My knees were a mess. I'm a golfer. It's a very big thing in my life to be able to get in my car and go to the club and hit golf balls and practice. And I couldn't do this. My pain was so bad, I even considered surgery. I didn't want to have surgery because it would take me out of what I like to do too long. And I wanted to see if there was something out there that would prevent this. Do you suffer with arthritis pain? Is it keeping you from the activities you love and you feel that surgery is your only option? Then you need to call Arthritis Knee Pain Centers for a free, no obligation screening today. Call 800-915-5717. That's 800-915-5717. Arthritis Knee Pain Centers use cutting edge, image guided treatments that place a natural lubricating gel directly into your affected joints. This FDA approved non-surgical procedure replenishes the missing cushioning fluid to provide you with comfort and pain relief. Before the treatment, I was limited on what I could do. It was frustrating. If you had asked me, would I be practicing every day, walking around, doing my gym work? I would have never thought that. I had the procedure done in my knee. It was a miracle. I couldn't believe the relief that I've got. These treatments help to improve your mobility without surgery or downtime. Arthritis Knee Pain Centers gave me relief that I was looking for. They care about your pain. Covered by Medicare and most private insurance, we've helped relieve the pain for over 50,000 patients. Arthritis Knee Pain Center relieved my pain and got my life back. The rest is history, baby. <laughs> Remember, our procedure is covered by Medicare and most private insurance. So get back to living your life and doing the things you love with less pain. Call Arthritis Knee Pain Centers and schedule your no-charge screening now. Call 800-915-5717. That's 800-915-5717. The truth revealed. You passed this test, you cleared your name, and then you don't have to put up with this. Weekdays at 2 on CW39 Houston.
when you're having fun with great friends. That's why I love this show. I've made so many friends along the way. So it's about 925. We're at that halfway mark. It means we're time to check in with producer Lou. She's entered the chat along with director Charlie. Hey, y'all. Hello. How's it going? Good. I, I did give my hat back. Is that not gorgeous? It's so gorgeous. I was actually really excited about your t-shirt as well. I know. So pretty. You have to go. I'm always looking out for you and your man. And yes. I think that that would be a great date night. I know. I think so, too. Date. It's like a fun kind of like dressing up night. I'm here for it. And you know what? A fun fact. I absolutely love the Kentucky Derby. Yeah. I'm here for it. I've been. I want to go back with Hefe and I want to take Well, me. let's go. Let's oh. double date. Okay. Let's go. Let's Teach go. me some Kentucky Derby. <laughs> also, you know what I love? What? A good ballpark hot dog. Yes, you do. I think you have an interesting story to tell me. <laughs> no, this one doesn't have to do with me. I can I can down a foot long, y'all. But uh, no, Producer Lou, I have a story to tell you about my mom and a hot dog. Well, they were flying at the Mets game. <laughs> Because <laughs> one of his hot dogs were got kicked dog. out. <laughs> they got kicked out, kicked out because of his hot dog? What? <laughs> That's today's Top Talker. I had to have it. Maggie, you came up with uh, this story in, the, in our morning meeting. We know we huddle and we talk about the show. And I was like, yes. I got to yes. tell you, it's a doggone good one, y'all. Yeah. Look at that. Flying wieners at the Mets ballpark. And she has a story and for you. Story so about please my mom. stick around. My mom's Don't probably like, it. no. Speaking of moms. Well, we have an activity for you and your mom if you don't want to go to the park and get hit by a wiener. I you mean, can paint a portrait in her honor. It's so much better. So we have our friends uh, uh, painting with a the twist. They're going to join us live in the studio. They're going to show us a little bit more about this fun event that you could do with your mom. Have you ever been? It's so much fun. Well, a fun fact, um, last week, me and my friends, we did this, but at home. So we <gasps> bought stuff off uh, Home Depot, Michaels, and <sighs> yeah, we to got some wine chill again. night. To be in your 20s again. <laughs> Producer Lou and I were talking yesterday, and May was in the background, and she <laughs> is my mini-me, and she drains in on the conversation, and I was like, enjoy your kid-free day. <laughs> <laughs> she was like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I yeah. told you, she says yeah the same way yeah. you say yeah. <laughs> and she laughs. I it's like her. Maggie. Reincarnated. <laughs> well, she really is. <laughs> All right, well, stay tuned. Yeah, we have plenty of Houston happens <laughs> after the break. Bad wreck. We don't take kindly to lousy deals from the greedy insurance company. From your medical expenses to your lost wages, the fight is on. Your call, 713-777-4000. I'm Bill Adler. I'm Jim Adler. The, the Texas, Texas Man. Boom. Next thing I know, I'll start in a car accident. A car accident can hit you out of nowhere. But when you call us, boom. Just like that, we can help you get your life back on track. Boom, baby. We're the Law Brothers. Call now or visit lawbrothers.com. Would you buy a life insurance policy if you knew your rate increased every five years? What if $9.95 a month bought you less than $1,000 in protection? Sadly, many policies that seniors buy today fail to mention this in their advertisements. You could buy a policy that might not give you enough coverage when you need it most. Call now to receive free information on the Senior Care Plan from Senior Life Insurance Company. The Senior Care Plan guarantees your rates cannot increase. Your benefit will never decrease. There is no medical exam, and you will have lifetime coverage. You could qualify for up to $30,000 in whole life protection, and rates start as low as $5.90 a month. With the Senior Care Plan, your coverage can start immediately, unlike other policies that don't give you full coverage for two years. Call now for free information on the Senior Care Plan from Senior Life. By calling now, you lock in the lowest rate possible. You have no obligation. Call now. Thinking of selling your house? I'm JR with SellTheJR.com and I'll buy your house as is. I'll give you a cash offer within 24 hours. SellTheJR.com makes selling your home easy. We buy houses in any condition. We can work through any situation. With SellTheJR.com, there are no strangers walking through your house, no closing costs, no commissions, and no repairs. Go to SellTheJR.com for your free, no obligation cash offer. Hot Bench, today at 10 and 10.30 on CW39 Houston. You know I got two homers. You got two jets. And then my Grand Slam. 
Uh, I signed the ball for you. Okay. And it says, Papa, I love you. Why did you do that? Because you taught me everything about baseball. I'm fine. I'm so sweet. Oh, Papa, I love you. Thank you. Thank That you deserve medical and hospital bills, lost wages, car, or truck repair. Jim Adler, the Texas Hammer, got your back. Call now for a free case evaluation. All right, welcome to the second half hour of Houston Happens, and we are starting off with today's top talker. Well, hot diggity. Dog. Apparently, I hope I can get through this. One Mets fan did a little too much hot dogging at Dollar Dog Night. You guys have to check this out. One more dog. That's what they were chanting. This fan loves his ballpark dogs, according to fans on X. During the ninth inning, everyone started tossing their wieners, their hot dogs at him, and he kept chowing down. Watch out, Joey Chestnut. Eventually, it got a little out of hand, and police had to remove him from the stands. Yeah. As far as how many dogs he chowed down, a fellow Mets fan posted this on X. They ran into him on the train after the game. It looks like he had, I counted, nine dogs, and he washed him down with ten beers. Oh, and by the way, the Mets won. What a dog god! Entertaining. Uh. <laughs> Could you imagine? So, you know, I'm so excited. I have to just share a personal story. Oh. Oh, yeah. No, it's about my mom. Hi, mommy. She hates hot dogs. Hates them. They really? gross her out. Meanwhile, my dad and I, like, I get it from my daddy. I love a hot dog. I can eat hot dogs. Yeah. I love hot dogs. My mom's like, oh. So we're at the game, and my mom's so prim and proper, <laughs> sitting nicely, and she's very soft spoken. And all of a sudden, out of nowhere, a foul ball comes, yeah, right? Yeah. So what do people do? They go to catch it. Yes. This guy also was eating his hot dog. So he went, <laughs> the wiener went out of the bun, <gasps> flipping. <laughs> She a just stranger's goes. wiener in my mom's lap. She goes, ah. Of course, we're all like, ah. But get this, you know. Because you didn't know what was happening. Gravity. No. Ketchup or <gasps> mustard landed on Mama Marguerite's lap. Yay! Just a strange man's wiener. <laughs> oh, my So gosh. now my mom always says, <laughs> carry your insurance <laughs> card when you go to the ballpark because of flying <laughs> wieners <laughs> <laughs> well, like, okay, so why does she not like them? Is it just the taste, or what is it? How they're made. Her brother, oh. you know, she's old as a five. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so who had to remove it? Um, I think, I don't remember so, that like, part. Obviously, she didn't need she's it. not going to take it. I think touch she it. gave it back. I mean, it's been a joke. My poor mother. Only things like this happen to her. But, uh, yeah. This guy, he got injected. He's not in trouble, but too many people were throwing him. But also, he was eating hot dogs that other people were touching. Yeah, that's kind of gross. But also, he had 10 beers in him. <laughs> I wouldn't be able to stand. I'd be throwing up, for sure. All right, so that's a fun fact, you guys. We had to lighten things up, especially with all this weather, right? But now I really want to address a very important topic. Cystic fibrosis, or CF. It's actually a rare genetic disease that currently affects about 40,000 people in the United States. And May, if you didn't know, is CF Awareness Month. And we're actually joined now by Casey White, the board chair for the Cystic Fibrosis Foundation and the first person with the disease to lead the organization. Thank you so much for waking up with us. Oh, well, thank you so much for having me. It's always a great day when I get to talk about the CF story and uh, the CF Foundation, an organization that means so much to me. And it really does. They're lucky to have you, I told you, because of the personal experience you're having. So tell us a little bit about what is cystic fibrosis and how does it affect day-to-day -day life? 
Uh, cystic fibrosis is a rare progressive genetic disease that affects the lungs and the pancreas and other organs. And as you said, about 40,000 people in the U.S. live with cystic fibrosis. It can impact all races and ethnicities. Um, and, you know, CF is a complex disease, so it affects each person differently. For some, managing their CF is their full-time job. Uh, treatments include um, breathing, treatments through a nebulizer, uh, airway clearance, countless pills, and when the infection in our lungs are particularly bad, we may need to be hospitalized for um, IV antibiotics. For others, because of advances in research, they're able to manage their disease while also work and have families. So we're making progress, but our job is not done. Our goal is to have a cure for every person with CF. Geez, that's amazing. Now tell me, how does this personally impact you? What's your day-to-day -day life and what milestones have you overcome? Well, when I was diagnosed with CF in the early 80s, the life expectancy was about 15 years old. Um, but my grandfather had a motto of thou shalt go for it. And that is the approach that we have taken to manage my disease. My family and I got involved in fundraising uh, as soon as I was diagnosed because we really believe in the mission of the CF Foundation. Um, it hasn't been easy. I've had multiple hospitalizations and IV antibiotics and countless but I just celebrated my 45th birthday, so I've officially tripled life expectancy. I'm a wife and a mom and a high school lacrosse coach, and having the honor of serving as the chair of the Board of Trustees truly feels like a dream come true. I didn't even know I could dream, and I'm so grateful to be able to give back uh, to this amazing organization. Seeing those pictures really touched my heart. So I'm so proud of you and what an achievement you've had. Tell us a little bit about the foundation and how we can get involved. Well, thank you. What I appreciate most about the CF Foundation is the holistic approach um, they take to support people with CF. We're currently investing in um, the best cutting edge science, particularly in the genetic technology space. We believe this is the science that will lead to a cure. We also invest in care centers across the country to ensure that people with CF have access to high quality specialized care. And we also know that um, support and connection um, is so important to managing this disease. So we um, have um, nearly 70 uh, CF Foundation chapters across the country, and this allows um, people with CF and their families to participate in fundraising events and uh, learn and inspire each other. Um, so we're, we're very grateful um, for our incredible community. And lastly, where can everybody go for more information? Yeah, well, there's never been a better time to get involved with the CF Foundation. I know I'm alive today because of the generosity of so many others. And I truly believe that we can find a cure in my lifetime, but we need your help. And the best way to get involved is to connect with your local chapter. If you go to cff.org slash CF month, you can learn more about your chapter and the amazing events that they put on throughout the year. And we'd absolutely love to have you as part of our team. Well, we want to be part of your team. Thank you so much for waking up with us. And again, congrats on all of your achievements and making a difference. She's really, really incredible. I mean, how lucky are they to have her, Edo, you know, then on the board? And three times, that's the life expectancy. She's outlived that. So happy birthday to her. Yeah, happy birthday. I, I just look up to her so much and just the optimism and how she's selflessly putting herself into all this work. I truly admire that. Me too. And then seeing pictures of her with her family, mm -hmm. that's what it's all about. So yeah, really an amazing woman and an amazing organization. All right, Ito, you have been very busy. Take yes. a deep breath, but this has been bad. Now here locally, we're like, wait, what are you talking about with all this rain? That, but, so tell, can you tell everybody exactly where it is and what we can expect here locally? No, you're right, Maggie. Houston proper itself hasn't really seen very much action. We've known since yesterday that most or the bulk of the showers happening this morning were going to be north of I-10. But by this afternoon, that line of shower activity will start to sag down. And yes, Houston will be seeing possibly some thunderstorms later on this afternoon. I'll be tracking that for you coming up here in just a minute with future track. But right now, let's focus on now because take a look at radar. We have several 
green outlines on here. And Maggie, so you know, those are flash flood warnings. That means we have flash flooding, flooding happening right now in several of our communities. I'm going to go ahead and get a little bit closer because Huntsville, we got some really incredible video from there. Mm -hmm. Maggie of some flash flooding. You see other cars just getting inundated with fast moving water and it only takes six inches for a car to be swept away. Huntsville still getting rain. What's happening is we have these storms coming in. They're dumping three inches of rain per hour and I'm two two inches is just a lot to begin with and then we also have training with these storms Maggie that means they're just setting up over and over again in the same spot. So I want to go through these flash flood warnings really quickly. We have this one, including for Huntsville, for Grimes, Montgomery, Walker, and Waller counties. That one goes until 1215 because we will continue to see rain pouring through these areas. Here's a look right now at the one affecting Montgomery, Polk, San Jacinto, and Walker County. That's going just for another 20 minutes, but I won't be surprised if they do extend this because we continue to see rain in this area, Maggie. So, you know, got 5 to 11 inches already today. So let's go ahead and look here at our flood alerts across the rest of the area. We do have even a flood watch for Harris County again because of those storms coming in later on today and just really quickly I want to take you into future cast because that's going to show us that today at 10 a.m. There is that rain, which we see now on radar. As I put this into motion for noon, here it comes, Maggie. 3, 4 p.m. We're going to start to see some showers and thunderstorms develop around Houston, Harris County, Galveston. No, we're not going to get as much as they have been in the northern counties, thankfully, because I definitely don't want to see any urban flooding. Right. All right. Well, thank you so much. What I love about you, you know, you're so smart and you, oh. yeah, you don't let people freak out about weather, but you break it down where we understand it. So thank you so much for doing that. I always value what you say. I'm clipping this and I'm just going to play every time I feel bad or blue. I'm like, mm, I'm going to play. No, it's this. really true though. Oh, it's I true appreciate you. And my parents say the same thing and my husband. So, and guess it. what? You're also an amazing mom. We want to celebrate you. We also, coming up on today's show, we have more Mother's Day activities for you and your mom that you can do next Sunday, paint a portrait in her honor. Our friends at Painting with a Twist, uh, Twist, I should say, are here to show us more. Who are you? I don't even know you. Uh, you don't ask questions. I ask questions. Hot Bench, next on CW39 Houston. A big insurance company can grind out tens of thousands of claims per day. After a car accident, you're just a name they don't know and a face they won't see. To them, it's just business, but to you, it's personal. If you've been injured, call Terry Bryant. That will let them know that you've got serious attorneys on your side who will fight to make your claim one the insurance company cannot ignore. Call 713-973-8888. Hi, I'm Lee Trevino. Most people know me for winning six PGA championships. With my bum knee, I started thinking I was going to have to trade my club in for a cane. Then I discovered Arthritis Knee Pain Centers. Arthritis Knee Pain Centers has cutting-edge image-guided treatments that place a natural lubricating gel directly into your affected joints. This FDA-approved non-surgical procedure replenishes the missing cushioning fluid to provide you with pain relief comfort and improved mobility without surgery or downtime. It's covered by Medicare and most private insurance. We've helped relieve the pain for thousands of our patients. Arthritis knee pain centers relieve my pain and change my life. They got me back in the game again, baby. Call them now and schedule your free knee pain assessment. Get the pain relief you deserve today. Call 800-925-6863. That's 800-925-6863. Dexcom G7 is one of the easiest ways to take better control of your diabetes. It replaces finger sticks, lowers A1C, and it's covered by Medicare. This small wearable sends my glucose numbers right to my phone or my receiver, so I can quickly get my glucose under control and take action. My A1C has never been lower. Now, my A1C is 5.7. Call now to get started on Dexcom G7, the number one most recommended CGM brand. Healthcare.gov is here for you when life happens. If you lost your health coverage because of turning 26, going off Medicaid, leaving your job, or moving, you could be eligible to enroll in new coverage now. And if you need to update your coverage because of marriage or having a baby, 
you can also be eligible. But don't wait. There's a limited time to enroll. Check your eligibility at healthcare.gov today. Life happens. Get covered. Well, there is nothing like a mother-daughter date. I know I really enjoy them with my mom. And this Mother's Day, paint a special work of art in honor of her this Mother's Day. So joining us to demonstrate, we have some very good friends. Introduce yourselves. Jerry Neese. Kiyosha Donaldson. Well, ladies, I am so excited about this. I told you I've done this. It's so much fun. Yes. But to do it with your mom. Yes. So tell us a little bit about what you guys have going on. So what we have is actually starting Friday, Saturday, Sunday of that weekend, we have throughout the day, um, starting from at least 4 o'clock until all day Saturday and Sunday, moms can come out with their um, daughters or daughters bring their mothers. And we have Mommy Me. We have all kinds of different things going on. We have like flower bouquets. <gasps> we have the Highland Calf. We even have our Hello Beautiful where they can paint themselves. Oh my gosh. So tell me a little bit about what we're going to be doing here. Um, so right now, um, this is like uh, a couple's with your daughter and your mother. Uh -huh. So it's actually half. So I just painted it so we can do it together. Oh, I love this. Okay, yes. can you yes, walk yes, me yes, through yes. it? So what does somebody experience when they come? So when they come in, they see us. We have the music going. We have a nice party mm -hmm. going. Um, we go over like all of the instructions instructions and then we have a good time and then you can bring your own uh, wine or any kind of adult beverage so yes it's just a party in itself it really is yes. you guys I've done this and it's so much fun mm -hmm. all right so fun. walk me through what we're gonna okay, do okay so we're gonna make like little stars in the background <gasps> oh okay so instead of using the front of your paintbrush you're gonna use the back of it okay this is what I love I kind of feel like I'm an artist I told you I did this with my husband his yes. was way better than yeah. mine way better mine kind of I start getting kind of nervous like oh my gosh I gotta keep up no, but we're here for fun, not perfection, so you right. always have to exactly. think That's something I'm working on, yeah. girlfriend. <laughs> Come on, help relax. We're All right, so relax. All right, so we're going to use the back of, I'm going to show you, and then you do okay. your own, and then you're just going to dot right here, and then take your finger, and you're just going to make... Finger painting. Yes. <laughs> so, you're gonna make it. so you do it anywhere you want to, so I'm going to dip it here. I'll do that. Just dip anyone. Dip yeah. it. Mm -hmm. And we always want to roll up our sleeves and not get the paint on our clothes. And then I use, what, I just rub yeah. it? Uh-huh, mm -hmm. and just in a circular motion. Yep. There you go. Oh, and you made it nice. Let me, can I show yes. it? Please, please, please. So you guys are actual artists. Yes. Yeah. How I'm, did you guys get involved with so this? So I'm the owner of Four Studios. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, that's yes, amazing. Yes. What does it mean to you to know that people are making so many memories through art? It's, it's a lot of fun. I enjoy being able to bring it to everybody. It's for all ages, you know, it's for a big diverse of people. Mm -hmm. She's actually one of my artists. She's amazing. Aww. Yes, yes. You can find her in the Pearland Studio. She's okay. amazing. I'm a five-star artist, Google star artist. Yeah, so. five stars. You have to come to Pearland. That's yes. amazing. The fact <laughs> you guys do sunflowers, can I tell you sunflowers is my favorite flower? Me too. Yes, my favorite color is yellow. Oh my Yes. Yes, my yes. Nana, that was her flower, and it's yes. my flower, so yes. I'm here for yes. all of this. So many. Oh, I'm so excited. Where yes. can we go for more, and do we need to, like, book ahead? So we have a website, uh, paintingwiththetwist.com, and if you want to go to the Pearland, you do backslash Pearland. It takes you right to the Pearland um, website. So there's different websites for different areas, but you can always Google it and find us. We're on Google Reviews, and uh, you can find us on the website. So I have to say thank you, because to me, what I miss since I've become a mom myself I'm so busy I miss just time with my mom alone oh, so this is a great yeah. gift to do yeah and making memories and yes. uh, book Kiki okay <laughs> Mother's Day, there's also something cool you can do with your mom next Sunday after we come visit you all. Yes, yes. Families are invited to the Houston Botanic Garden for the city's inaugural Mother's Day Walk and Wellness Day oh. for a cause, you all. The garden says it's a nearly two-mile self-paced walk. It's going to feature interactive, inspiring, and fun experiences to help families unwind, bond, and create special memories together in nature. Maybe see a sunflower. Yes. It's happening on Mother's Day, May 12th from 10 in the morning until 2 in the afternoon. So many fun things to do, like a stretch session. I need that. This one's kind of interesting. Not sure how I do it. This a Ninja Warrior style obstacle course, empowerment and reflection sessions, a children's zone, and so much more. If you guys haven't been out there, it's really breathtaking. Wow. Also, yes. this is like document documenting you and your mom mm -hmm. forever. Yes. Another form of art that does it is photography, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, so we actually want to check in with Ido because she has more on how two experts are 
are documenting the breathtaking, one of my favorite places, Yellowstone National Park. Thanks again, ladies. Thank yes, you. thank you. We appreciate it. In the spirit of Earth Day, we are joined by two acclaimed guests, Chas Glatzer and Nathan Lee Allen, to highlight the changes at Yellowstone National Park and the importance of preserving the beauty of this national treasure. Gentlemen, thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank you for having us. Yeah, it's great to be here. I gotta tell you, I love Yellowstone National Park, but I wanna hear your takeaways of, jo of going to that, as you said, national treasure, especially with Canon. So I, I've been photographing in the park for the 20 years, um, mostly winters, but we've been going in the spring and the, and the summers as well. And Canon has always been a valuable partner in creating gear that helps me be able to tell my visually compelling stories. Um, I was glad this time to be joined by Nathan um, on this particular project, someone who focuses on video content creation, he won't admit it, but he takes killer stills. Um, and I literally saw yes. things through, uh, through a different lens and perspective. Yeah, no, to echo what Chad said, I think for me, the biggest takeaway was just experiencing the park through his perspective and his, uh, you know, seeing his passion for the park. And like you said, over 20 years photographing Yellowstone, uh, it was amazing just to learn from him. And it was great to leverage his voice uh, in the film Seismic, and it was just a no brainer. And I also just love to see uh, that same passion that he has for Yellowstone echoed by our partners at Canon. Ooh, and I saw that camera was beautiful. Also, Chaz, brave, going to Yellowstone in winter. Kudos, my man. <laughs> All right, you, yeah, mentioned, uh, 40. <laughs> you mentioned seismic. So let's talk more about that film. What was the goal with it? So my goal was always is to get people to appreciate Yellowstone, experience its magnitude, and, and this project was a perfect venue to, to promote that opportunity. Um, it was also unique for me. I'm, I'm typically behind the camera. This time I was in front of it and uh, I got to uh, have Nathan videotape me and show my passion and deep respect for the park uh, through his creative eye. So that was pretty rewarding. Yeah, no, I think also for us, like filming the, the this, uh, this documentary, we had two main goals. And one was obviously to showcase the beauty of Yellowstone and how diverse it is, how dynamic it is, and how it deserves protecting and preserving. But also we wanted to draw attention to Canon and the support and equipment that they provide, like the Canon EOS R5C that helped film this project. Uh, this all helps sustain the park for the future. Okay, let's talk about the future. Yeah. You have been able to document the park with your Canon cameras this whole time. What kind of changes have you seen during that evolution of your work? So I, I first went in 88 and we had those big fires and I've got to witness the whole landscape transform itself you know, from being burnt to crisp to, you know, flourishing again uh, now as it is in the park. And we've seen the animals migrate and change and all that kind of stuff. And um, our feature seismic has enabled us to see that. And we've had the global pandemic. The park is now experiencing a uh, record number of visitors because of that. Um, a lot of people stopped traveling overseas. So we had a constant shift in the wild activities in the parks are monitoring that. Canon recently put a PTZ camera up in uh, Old Faithful area so we can live stream and get to see the uh, Wapiti Wolf Pack recently um, in the Upper Geyser Basin. Yeah, to echo what Shaz said, I think uh, the future, um, you know, there's there's so much uh, exposure and so many more people coming to the park. I think uh, if that exposure turns to support, whether it's people on the ground like Shaz, whether it's nonprofits like Yellowstone Forever that's doing amazing work every single day in the park, to our partners at Canon that are helping with conservation efforts and providing cutting edge technology like the Canon EOS R5C, the future of the park is bright, in my opinion. Yep. It most definitely is. Thank you, you two, for all the work you're doing to bring awareness of this beautiful, truly national treasure, national uh, Yellowstone National Park. And thank you for joining us today. Thank you. You guys can see more information if you head over to usa.canon.com. And you can learn more at Yellowstone.org. Definitely check it out. The new $1.99 Sonic Crispy Tender Wraps are here for a limited time in bold flavors like Hickory Barbecue or Cheesy Baja. Give yourself some TLC, tender, love, and chicken for only $1.99. Sonic Crispy Tender Wraps. Have heart failure with unresolved symptoms? It may be time to see the bigger picture. Heart failure and seemingly unrelated symptoms like carpal tunnel syndrome, shortness of breath, and irregular heartbeat could be something more serious called ATTRCM, a rare underdiagnosed disease that worsens over time. Sound like you? Call your cardiologist and ask about ATTRCM. Another 
your year of yo-yo dieting? Not this year. Hit reset and make a permanent change with permanent fat removal by Sonobello. With Sonobello, day one, all my unwanted body fat gone. These are my favorite pair of jeans that I couldn't even button up. Look how flat my stomach is. I couldn't believe, like, it was just gone. I saw the results immediately. And this is the best I have felt since I was in my 20s. Real women everywhere are transforming their bodies permanently. Sono Bello is not a fad diet or boot camp workout. It's a simple, proven way to remove stubborn body fat permanently and in just one visit. I'm so happy I just put this dress on that I haven't worn in over 10 years. If you are looking for physical results and positive emotional results, please run, don't walk to your nearest Sono Bello. Ready to hit reset? Find out how you can save $250 off instantly. Call now or go to sonobello.com. Why choose a Sleep Number smart bed? Can it keep me warm when I'm cold? Wait, no, I'm always hot. Sleep Number does that. Can I make my side softer? Can I make my side firmer? Sleep Number does that. Can I help us sleep better and better? Please. Sleep Number does that. 94% of smart sleepers report better sleep. Save 40% on the Sleep Number Limited Edition Smart Bed or 0% interest for 36 months. Shop now at sleepnumber.com. News Nation is at the border. They're calling it migrant crime. They live it every single day. To give you the whole picture. Cartel promised him easy money. Made a huge mistake. Just like that, life changes. Allie Bradley, another reason to trust News Nation. I know, you can't take your eyes off the Sonic Garlic Butter Bacon Cheeseburger. Don't worry, it's not going anywhere. Here's why. Garlic butter, cheese, garlic butter, bacon, garlic butter. Need we say more? Sonic Garlic Butter Bacon Cheeseburger. Well, that's nearly a wrap on today's show. But before we go, here's a look at today's sponsored content brought to you by Canon USA Inc., Techish.com, and the Cystic Fibrosis Foundation. And of course, we will see you back here tomorrow morning, same place, same time for more Houston Happens. I'm so excited because it is going to be a Fiesta Friday. We are getting ready for Cinco de Mayo with live in-studio performances and so much more. You don't want to miss it. In the meantime, stay safe in the weather and bye for now.